I spoke with those who are packing up and leaving Gold Bar and Index, as well as those who made the decision to stay here and wait it out. They say living so close to the Skycomish River, they're used to flooding, but nothing like this. Have a nice day. Be safe. Turning car after car away on Highway 2 east of Gold Bar. Uh, I have I have some chickens there. I wanted to probably get out of there. Okay. They won't let me. Those that had already packed up their homes and left weren't allowed to go back. Well, I'm just loading up the last of my stuff um, and heading out. The sun barely seen through the smoke as Bryce White packs his last cherished items. So I'm just, yeah, we're just grateful we had a place to, to go and um, we'll just see how things work out the next few days. The last time White saw ash fall like this was when Mount St. Helens blew, pulling out of his driveway they just changed the rating, so I'm I'm out of here. So he's unsure what the next couple of days will bring. It it'd be nice to uh, have it here still. We might dodge it, but who knows? But if not, we'll just rebuild again. It's desolate. It's it's eerie. Up the road, Casey Letterman with Skyland Ranch made the quick decision to evacuate Saturday. Right now, we are clearly animalless, which is a first in probably the history of the ranch right now. She's currently in a level two evacuation. Be ready at short notice. Uh, with the quantity of animals and people and everything that we're looking out for, you got to kind of call it early, even if it ends up being you know, better safe than sorry. Taking four to five hours to move over 40 cows, horses and dogs. They're all running loose on a friend's farm right now together, which is going to be a new challenge of catching some of the cows, horses and stuff the way that they scattered, but they're happy and they're safe. So that's all that matters. At this point, many are stuck waiting to see what happens. Two days from now, this whole situation can be absolutely different. So we're kind of just going to have to ride it out and kind of deal with the eeriness of it. In Gold Bar, I'm Kristen Goodwillie, King 5 News.